All right, what's up guys? Welcome back to some more of the Golf Club 2019 Career Mode. This is part number 30. We're 30 parts in now. There has been a bit of a delay, but the parts are going to be a little bit more sporadic at the moment uh, because I'm kind of busier with other parts of the Golf Club. I'm, I'm competing in the Galactic Cup, which is a solo tournament. I'm in the group stages of that at the moment. I streamed the first two matches and I won both of them, uh, but I have two hard matches coming up this week, so uh, they've also b won both their matches. There's six people in each group. Uh, I'm not sure how many groups there is, but then it goes on to the knockout stages. The top two guys from each group go through. So I'll have to win at least one out of the two matches these, this week if I want to have a chance of going through. And then I'll have one more match next week, I believe. So yeah, uh, if you're interested in the Galactic Cup streams and the All Shot League streams, make sure to turn on post notifications for the channel. That will notify you when I go live. Sometimes that doesn't work, so if, if it doesn't uh, work for you, you can always follow me on Twitter and turn on my, um, my notifications there because I always tweet when I go live. But I just thought I'd mention that for anyone that was missing the streams that perhaps wants to watch them. Not everybody is going to want to watch the streams, but I, I would recommend it if you're interested in this career mode. Because I, I, it's really competitive, it's a lot of fun, especially the all shot with Tyler. Um, we stream it together. Uh, so yeah, um, we're going to jump into the first round of the Columbus Cup here at Emerald Lake Golf Club. DJ is absolutely dominating this tournament so far, 7 under through 12 holes. Uh, also, I did get channel membership now as well. Uh, I just thought I'd plug myself a little bit here uh, early on in the video. If you guys do want to become a channel member, uh, it's the best best way, best possible way to support the channel. Uh, it's five euro a month. Basically, uh, I'll get 70% of that. Uh, YouTube takes the other 30%. And then uh, you'll get a custom, uh, custom loyalty well, badge is what they call it, I believe. And you'll also get custom emotes. You can use that in the chat. I think you can use it in the comments as well of just normal videos. You'll have the badge in, in the comments of normal videos and in the streams as well. Uh, so yeah, I just thought I'd mention that in case anyone does want to support the channel. You don't have to, obviously. It's not You're not obliged to at all. And, but just in case you wanted to... Par 4 to start with. Just this in case you wanted to get do something extra. And there you go. That's a perfect to drive to start off at Emerald Lake the Golf Club. It wasn't perfectly green. struck, but it's going to Let's end up this perfect. Next golfer does. Thanks, John. Conditions yeah, sorry for the plug at the start of the video. I just kind of wanted to mention that because it's something new. I, like uh, I just got it. And from 160 and, uh, yards out. I believe you're not supposed to get it until you get like 100,000 subscribers, but I got it, I guess, a little bit earlier. I don't know why. But Team YouTube in, uh, emailed me yesterday and just told me that it's now active on my channel, so I thought I'd mention that to you guys. And let's uh, stick this one close. It looks like a seven iron. Pretty good shot. And this one's looking pretty good. That's pretty good, man. We'll take that. We'll take that. Good start. The Columbus Cup. This should be a fun one. Last part was the Players' Championship. Uh, I did do another event since then, but I missed the cut, so I didn't bother uploading that one. The cup. Oh my god, the screen. Jesus Christ, this is a tough putt. Damn it. Ooh, that one's, uh, man, I really thought that was going to be a gimme pretty much, but that was a very difficult putt. And this putt is four par. And two good shots is not good enough to get me a bird. Oh my god! I just nearly missed that. And starting to Can you imagine? Oh, I probably man. would have just turned off my recording right now. Dustin Johnson, 7 under through 12 holes. If we had 3 putted from goddamn 10 foot, factor on this I would have had to just uh, shot goes. rethink my life. Can we get driver here? Driver with a big fade. A big draw, rather. It's gotta be good. It's gonna bounce off the rock. Yeah, this shot he's taken <laughs> through the branches. It's perfect now. Bounces off the rock and comes out into the middle of the fairway. Yeah, perfect. Wrong with that shot. Not a good strike either, though. I need to start uh, 20 yards striking out. these a lot better. 11 mile an hour wins. Okay, I'm going to go with the 136 then. With a little bit of loft. That's going more like it. A pitching wedge here. That was a perfect shot. My approach shots have been yeah, good. It's just my drives have been a little fast. Green. Maybe I shouldn't have put any loft on it. That's pretty damn good, though. And, and we have a chance to open our birdie account. This pot is for birdie. This one's a little easier. And we just and about make it. Drop. So, there you have it. Our first and birdie of the day. We're on top of the one shot closer to Dustin Johnson. Seven under. And Alex Naren as well, just behind him. And now, the third hole tee off. This is a cool course, though. Ooh, this is a nice looking hole. Lighthouse and everything there. 
downhill, but uh, wind into us. 12 mile an hour. Yikes. I don't know what to hit here. I think I'm going to hit the 225 with a good bit of loft. Ooh, it was a really good strike. Wait, what? He might be flying the green here. Wait, what? Oh, is it because at the very start there's a little flick out to the right no, or something? I don't think they meant to do that. Because it looked like pretty much dead straight. And I am pretty sure the wind had okay. something to do with that. Fast backs went barely, though, and it affected it that much. Jesus Christ. Now we're struggling for par on this hole. is needed to save par. And it's not an easy one at all. But we've made it. Let's go. Just about. I thought it was going to fuck out when I said, but we've made it. <laughs> but that's in. That's a great par right there. We stay at one under. Bogies are not acceptable, man. We got to just keep them off the card. Next up is the par five. Keep them off the card, man. And we got a par five coming up as well. So that par save is huge there. Make sure that we do not go in that bunker. That's for sure past that bunker. On the left hand side, and that's just absolutely perfect. We should be able to go for it in two. I didn't actually even check how long this hole was, but with a 330 yard drive, pretty much. Yep, exactly 330 yards. Yeah, I think he'll we be should happy be able to go at this green in two. Yards out. Oh, it's pretty long, actually. 250 might be the right club here, because it's 48 foot up. It's pretty high. Well, it just kind of flicked left at the end, unfortunately. As you can see. It would have been too much either way. Well, that's going to be a long-ass putt now. Get off the green. Get off the green. Give me a chip. All right. That's probably going to be a little bit easier, to be honest, than a putt from that length. That would be a very, very difficult putt. I'm going to flop this. The old flopperoony, I think, is the way to go with these 30-yarders. It's the easiest shot. Again with the fast backswing, man. Didn't affect it that much, okay? That's actually perfect. I'm gonna get the That's fast backswing on those chips. From the cup. Boom! The bird. I guess I'm just flicking it forward a little bit too soon. Is that why it's fast? And our leader and the score to beat currently seven under par. Mm-hmm. Alright, two under. Alex Narn and Dustin Johnson both seven under. Alex Narn has finished his round. Okay, Dustin Johnson still has three holes to go, and this is a reachable par four. This is very reachable. Honestly, driver is probably going to be too much, but three wood won't be enough. So let's just try and hit the driver flat out and see what happens. That is so far. It's literally pitching too far. All right, it'll be a flop from here. That won't be too bad. I hit that as well as I could have hit it. Perfect, perfect. And is this a chip or a flop? Um, 24 yard flop, possibly? Question mark? Again, fast. Yeah. Spin. Pretty damn good, though. That's pretty damn good, and that is another birdie. Back to back birdies. This course is pretty, this pretty handy, it seems like. This footer. A lot of nice holes on it. Cool yeah, course, though. The, what is this? The birdie. Emerald Isle. I think I've played this one a few times. I don't know, though. It seems and like I haven't. Move I don't recognize this that, hole. that much. I don't recognize and it at all, really. Off on the par five. But I feel like I know the name. I played it, but... I don't know. All right. That tree is in the way, so I'm going to play a little bit of a fade rather than aiming out right. And as well as hitting a fade, oh, I this actually is a tough call. Could be rough, could be just uh, pushed it. And that's going to be bunker bound. Ooh, just stays out of the bunker. Hopefully we got a decent lie there. Oh, this is a par 5, okay. Yo, what the fuck am I supposed to do here? I can probably reach that to be quite perfectly honest. It's not even up. Alright, watch this. You're about to see a monster fade. That was nearly enough. It's a great shot, though. Imagine 
Needed a lot more fade. That's a good shot, though. Up and down for a birdie from there won't be bad. That's a really good strike. At the right distance, pretty much, and 20 yards. Try that flop again, because it worked out so wonderfully last time. And even if it pitches too far, it's going to spin back here because of the hill. Definitely, definitely not going to spin back from there. Please. Oh, thank God it still did. Holy shit, that was close to being, like, staying up there. That was a bad flop, and now it's just absolutely perfect. Got away with that one. That was fast, fast. And this putt... If there was no hill there, that would have been way too far and probably not a birdie. And but now, it's a birdie regardless. It doesn't matter. And we'll take that. Four under, four four under par. And Just three back of Alex Arn and Dustin Johnson now. And we're four under through and six holes, man. Let's go. Three. This ain't easy, though. This is not an easy par three. Holy shit. I'm going to hit the 183, I think. Should I go one less? Wait. Come on, man. Really? Why do I even need an online connection for fucking career mode, dude? What do you mean? Hey, that was annoying. Right, it wouldn't Luke, reconnect for like ages, but hole. we're back. We're gonna get Whatever. you right into the action now. That was a it perfect strike, like but I just hope iron. that it's not way too much. This is it's hard to judge, man. It's definitely too much. Definitely too much. I should hit the 170. It's not an awful shot, but... Yeah, that one is just really hard to judge. It's a lot, like when it's 69 foot down, it's really hard to like judge just how much that's going to take off it, but whatever. Let's get up and down. Very slow on the way through, Jesus. Should be a par though. And to save I would have taken par. a par on that hole, to be honest. It's a, not an easy hole whatsoever. I nearly fucking missed that. Some of these short putts, man. I don't understand. Now leader today like I actually played that outside the hole too. Par. Eight under, Dustin Johnson finished. Okay. And next up is a par four, folks. All right, we can catch Dustin. At least tie with him. For sure. All right, I'm gonna play it. Wait, can I just go over these three? I can probably just go over these, right? They're not that high. Yeah, I can. That's perfect. That's picture perfect. Well, this one's looking pretty good. Pretty good? That's monstrous. That's huge. That's 320, 6, 7, 8, 9, 330, baby. Let's go. 331. That's how it's done. And from 150 yards. From 150 yards. This is going to be uh, the 122 shot, to be perfectly honest, with that wind and that hill. Oh, it's struck with absolute venom and perfection as well. I think this is heading to the rough. Go! Oh, wait. I didn't mean to do that. What a shot. Okay, it was just enough. I pressed the touch by back in. It was just enough. Should have maybe put and some D loft on that, but it's, like that. it's perfect now. It's a Twelve good birdie chance, go too. Here. Breaks back at the end, so I don't know about this one. Yes! And that one will just adjusted it. And that works out a treat, and that's five under par. And that one, five under for the day. Through eight and holes, is it? Yeah, five under through eight. Not bad. On the leaderboard. Dustin was 7 under through 12. That's what we need to be. We need to match Dustin there. Well, I can go for this. No doubt. No freaking doubt. Play a little bit of a fade around those trees. Whenever I go to play a fade, I also hit it right. Uh, <laughs> so there's just no point in me playing the fade, man. I do not understand. I probably would have been able to go go over that tree if I just went straight up, straight at it. That's not a nice light, by the way. That ain't bad, though. That ain't bad at all. If I didn't put the D-loft on it, it probably would have been picture Very perfect. Nice shot out of the sand, and I think birdie's quite possible here. And that's Lord perfect. Birdie. And that's another birdie. We moved to six under and Luke is through nine holes. With us, uh, after what do you have to say, holes? Luke? What are you seeing out there on the course today? He's currently inside the top 10, but with the talent in this tournament, he'll need to keep making more birdies down the stretch if he wants to stay there. Thank you, Luke. Uh, now back to the action. That's left. Should and be okay, though. It's not promising. too far left to where it's detrimental. That's okay. That's fine. The Columbus Cup. 
We're about to win this Columbus Cup, baby. Come on. Perfect start. Couldn't ask for a better front nine than that to start off the tournament. And this is just going to be the perfect second shot as well. Watch this. Very slow. Damn it. Damn it. It would have been too far if it was perfect, but... It wouldn't have been down here, that's for sure. It would have been probably just at the back of the green. Sit. Sit. Sit! Not perfect, but it's not awful either. That's a tough and lie from there. for the birdie. Oh, this is for birdie still, yeah, huh? Get away with the birdie on this hole. No, nope, I missed it straight. Wow, it didn't turn at all. It literally went dead straight. And I hit it dead straight, too. Well, let's see how I played for break, but there was the literally none. And he's gonna move up Actually, none. That's that great. One. Par, though. A disappointing par. Setting up I wasn't, for the par wasn't four an overly tee difficult hole. That'll happen sometimes. You're not gonna birdie every par five. That is just, just actually smoking, perfect. Just actually perfect. And now it's our time to make another birdie. 316 yards up the right side of the fairway here. 165 yards to the pin. And this is a, a green light special, as they call it where I come from. I just the sliced the ever living shit this out of it. For the Catch that hill! Catch that hill! Uh, it's gonna be too far anyway, really? It was 11 foot up. Yeah, I guess it was. Pretty strong winds. 11 mile an hour. It's not that bad though. It's a relatively decent shot. And that one is on the green with quite a bit of real estate to make up on that next putt. Alright, watch this. In the middle. Nope. Okay, these oh, these greens just, like just misses. On the short ones they break really hard, yeah, but on the long ones they really don't break here. much at all. And a nice puff. Okay. That's par. And after that one stay in pretty Back to back par is to start off the back nine. On the this better not be one of those things where I have a really good front nine and then it just all pars back nine. Nice. That happens so often to me. See how this it's very, goes. very frustrating. Oh, just pulled it. This could be good. It's heading for the green here. Pretty decent for distance, I think. Maybe a little long, actually. Oh, it's coming back around, though. It's coming back around. Oh, yeah. Go on down towards that hole. That's what I like to see. A friendly bounce after a not-so-good shot. And about 14 feet away here. That gives us a little bit of a chance here. Remember, it doesn't break as much as... I think it does, so... I'm just gonna go straight at it, and that works. And that one a tree for the birdie. Just straight at it, and boom, in the middle. And there's seven under par for the a round. Birdie. After that we one. got lucky there, and to be honest. Tied for and second now we're place on the just tied board. for second, one and back of Dustin Johnson, and we have four. six holes to go. Got a lot of holes to make up this. Uh, there's no way I'm making that, is there? No, I'm just gonna hit. All right, there's no way I'm making that, even with that wind. 11 miles an hour, I don't think would take the well, carry so over that so water. This one. So I'll just hit a safe iron shot up the middle of the fairway. Oh, that got a horrible bounce. I thought that was going to go into the bunker for a second. I was like, please don't do that. And about 200 yards. Might as well hit it in the water if that was the case. A bit of a fade. Going to sit down. The green he's here. Sit down. He's to sit down. No, that's going off down the left side. That's unfortunate. Hmm. That's unfortunate. Kind of pulled it a little bit left, I guess. What's happening to the shot right now? Jesus. And please. Sometime today. This one's for birdie. Look at this, like a 72 footer. Jesus Christ. Let's do it. 74 footer even.
Hey, it's not Ooh, awful. It just That's misses. pretty damn good, actually. Especially for this distance, that two is feet from the cup. pretty damn perfect. And that one drops for par. And that's another par. <laughs> and after that hole, staying right there in second place. Don't do this to me, man. No, I made a birdie. I just made and a birdie. now teeing yeah. off on this it's par fine. four. I thought I'd made three pars in a row. It's fine. I'm going for the green here, baby. You already know. Yeah, I have played this course, actually. Fast? Really? I'm pretty sure this is going to land in the fairway here. Hit the tree and bounce into the hole. <laughs> oh my god, that went far. Oh my god. And it's a little unlucky. Unfortunately, that one actually ended up in the rough. Do you want to hit the flopper I think I do. The 24 yard flopper That's perfect. That's picture perfect. Oh, it just spun a little bit too much, but that's fine. Should be able to make it from there. Keep going. Ball was still moving there a little bit. And this putts for birdie. Oh my goodness, Josh. See, the one time I just hit it. I was like, yeah, they're not breaking much at all, so maybe I should just go straight at it. I know. I should have fucking moved it, dude. Even if I had kept it inside the and hole. After that, I don't know why I was thinking there. I, was just, the day. I wasn't and fucking he's thinking tied for third place. And that's a stupid and par. That should have been an easy the birdie five. there. God, that's so dumb. So annoying and dumb, in fact. Wait, where the fuck's the hole? Can I go up this fairway? This better not be out of bounds. Okay, this one's looking pretty good. <laughs> I'm just going up a completely different fairway. Yo, let's go. <laughs> See, we have a relatively short shot in. No, we don't. Pretty long, actually. Okay, I'm going to play out to the right and play a little bit of a fade. Or should I play out to the left? Yeah, I'll play out to the left. Uh, staying Looks out like there. this is... That ain't gonna come in. I pulled it a little bit. Alright, we can get up and down for a birdie, though. Come on, we need a birdie. We don't want to settle here. We want to start making some birdies. Got the flop is just at chip. It should be perfect. Sit. There you go. That has to be a birdie, man. I probably would have said the shame here. about my last putt, but. And boom. And that one goes there you have birdie. it. We make a birdie. And with that, he will move And that into a is just perfection. First. Eight under, tie for the lead. And setting up. Miss Putz has started peak. the round on Pinhook Saddle Cup. That's actually what I'm playing in the Galactic Cup, guys. So. It should be a fun one. She she won her first match eight, eight up. I don't know, like eight and seven or something. And then she won six and five or something like that. So. She's pretty insane, apparently. That's left. It should be fine. Yeah, this is not looking promising. Go! Oh, I thought it was going to be far enough. It's not far enough at all. Jesus Christ. Oh, my God. That's plugged, too. That's uh, that's just nasty. That's not the way to put it, Johnny. It's actually not that bad. Dude, I'm crazy. I don't actually care, so I'm going for it. No, there's no way I'm going for it. What am I talking about? It's just stupid. Hey, I probably would have been fine, actually, if I had went for it. <laughs> I would have been pitched on the green. And back in the fairway with not a whole lot of distance. Fast and slow. Great. That's just what you love to see. Fast and slow. The perfect combination. And about 18 feet to the cup. And we're about to make our first bogey of the round, I'm pretty sure. Unless we can hold an 18-footer here. Did not give it enough break. Oh, that was so, so close. No, man! And this for the bogey. The minute we tie the lead, we give it straight and back. That one in for Come on. Bogey. Come on, man. And look at this. I'm seeing quite a few. Gotta be better than that, dude. Right for him today. Let's tie okay, the lead again before the end of the round. This is a tough eight. part three. 215 yards. Over the water, downhill. 
You hit the 203, you know. What the fuck? Iron here. Dude, the I felt like I hit that dead straight. I'm genuinely serious. I felt I like I hit that dead straight. On Look one. how far I'm left that is. On that approach shot. I'm a genuine and shock with that one. Be like, I can't believe that, that just that. went that far past. Holy shit, bags. Finally hit a perfect, perfect flop, by the way. I love the sound of this. Hole just got a whole lot more possible with that shot. What? So Where was the break? Close. There was no break on my on my screen. Was there? Five feet to go. Here. Did I just completely miss that? No, there's no break there, even on the way back. What? And that drops for bogey. How did that break? And on that's back to back bogey. We'll go down in the standings after that one. And that's as very he depressing. He's off here on the eagle. eagle pole. He is only two strokes off the lead. Let's see what happens. I was tied for the lead just very recently, though, so that's not very good, is it? Get in the ferry, please. Stay in the light, roughly. Oh my god, it took a horrible kick back left! And it was I bouncing to the right, it took a horrible jump. kick back to the left. Are you shitting me? We would have been able to reach no problem as well if we were in the light rough. Like, no problem at all. That's depressing. Can't reach now. Can't reach now, that's for sure. Damn it, that's so depressing. Alright, we still need to make birdie though. It literally looked like I got the perfect bounce, and then it just bounces yeah, back the other way that it just bounced slide. from. Green is also God in damn Let's it, see man. what happens. Should I do? Should I go for a flop? 42 yard flop, and then just. What am I doing, dude? Holy shit. 42 yard flop with a better deal left, I think. Whoa, that went left, even though it was a dead straight flop. Nice it's coming back. What the fuck just happened to that? Alright, we're not making birdie. We're not making birdie, that's for sure. I have no idea what just happened to that one. We're far away from making birdie, though. But we'll make the par... And we'll have to settle for a disappointing six under because we went two over with for the last four holes. Hadn't made a bogey in the first. Uh, well, on behalf the first of John, Luke, many birdies though. Eight birdies, and uh, we, we we give ourselves a chance going into going into the final round, definitely. So uh, yeah, if you'd like to see that final round, please do thumbs up this video, give it a like, you know what I mean. And uh, we'll be back to do the final round. Uh, do we have a better round than Tiger Woods? Ooh, we're one ahead of him in the rival right now. One ahead of him in the rival. And Dustin Johnson, eight under par, leads the tournament with C. Franklin. I know him well. C. Franklin, you have if you don't know C. Franklin, you, you don't really know golf, guys. All right. I have no idea who is. So. All right, we're going to jump into the next round uh, in the next video. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. And I'll see you guys for part 31, hopefully very soon. Peace out.